Hello and welcome to another episode of, well, Frosty Gaming. But today I'm going to do something a little different and I'm going to show you a new game called Star Citizen. It looks fantastic. I'm very excited about this game. As you can see, look at the visuals. They're fantastic, right? Um, this game is being created by uh, Cloud Imperium Games and Chris Roberts, the godfather of modern space sim. He created Wing Commander, if you didn't know. And this game is going to be fantastic. I'm so excited about it. Because, well, you get to fly off a freaking character carrier in the single-player mode. I'm excited for that. As you can see, here's my uh, my purchase and contribution to the crowdfunding effort. My little Avenger that I will be flying proudly. It looks like a penguin, but I don't care. <laughs> Fits the frosty, right? But uh, as you can see, this game is going to be extremely detailed and... You can just suit up and get ready to go. Look at this dude. You can mount your weapons and, I mean, really just fly off into the blue yonder. Strap into that great beast of a machine and go. I mean, who doesn't want to do that? Who doesn't want to be freaking Han Solo from Star Wars? I mean, I do. I don't know who wouldn't. I mean, it's fantastic. This game is also going to include um, not just, you know, multiplayer, which is going to be with the persistent universe with the thousands of millions, actually millions of players and uh, about a trillion AI, if I remember. But it's also going to feature a campaign called Star uh, Squadron 42, uh, which you can go and um, campaign um, and learn kind of about the game and do a tour of duty, so to speak. Um, but you can see here that they've put a lot of work already into this game, creating the assets for the end product. Now, uh, you can see that the detail, the rust, the things they have put on this, um, on this Avenger, inside this Avenger even, are very, very, very detailed. Meticulous, almost. Uh, as you can see, I'm just walking into my cockpit, a little buggy, but hey, it's pre-alpha, I mean, don't expect everything. Um, so I can, you know, just swing into the cockpit, getting ready to fly off into the blue yonder, well, the deep black, if you want to be specific, but you, I mean look at this I mean when you get up close to stuff in other games it degrades it doesn't look good but when you get close to stuff in this game it doesn't it looks just as good as it did far away and I'm really excited about that because well it's gonna be like that in game also the HUD look at this this thing is fantastic they've already started um, implementing the systems um, required to change your ship parts and um, the one of the things that I was really quite surprised about is a uh, the attention to detail when it comes to lighting. I mean, just actually looking, you know, walking away and the lights turn back on, and then when you walk closer to the um, the uh, UI, you, it, it, it freaking gets darker. Now, as you can see, here's the, the Aurora commercial, and they've made a number of ship commercials. Uh, you've already seen the 300i, and I'll be showing the other one sooner. But the Aurora, I mean, I just, I think it's great how they're showing off the customizability that you can have with your ships. And, I mean, it's going to be just like this. You get in that little uh, interface there, you change your weapons out, you change your loadout. You uh, change, you know, your missiles or your power plant or whatever, and you can go out into the blue yonder and fly like Han Solo. I mean, that's fantastic, isn't it? Ah, uh, I mean, who doesn't want to do that? Who doesn't want to be a space pirate or a merchant or or even just a, a bounty hunter? I mean, like Django Fett, he's fantastic. But this game is gonna feature some crazy stuff, and I mean, with 37 million dollars and growing. I mean, you're going to be able to throw some serious cash at something that is going to look like that, hopefully, in the end product. It's very exciting. So, uh, I mean, you get to be like a merchant space pirate, but you also can, you know, dogfight with people, and it's got that Wing Commander-esque feel of uh, flying your ship across the galaxy. I mean, this Hornet commercial that we're showing right now, I mean, shows off Star Citizen's great visual effects I mean it's gonna look like you're flying in a movie and that's what's really cool too I mean it's gonna look like you're flying in a movie especially if you get an oculus which I'm thinking about getting when they release it because um, that then you can do those sort of like you can like check behind you check your six and etc I mean that that would be awesome but anyway if you're really interested in this game please go to robertspaceindustries.com and take a look they've got lots of great stuff 
and um, <laughs> it's really quite fantastic. You'll have to take a look. Anyway, it's Frosty, signing off.